El Paso Locomotive FC hit the training grounds again today. The team is coming off a big win over Phoenix Rising FC last Saturday. The 1-0 victory was the club's first ever over their Western Conference foe. Now the Locomotive are looking forward to what is next on the tracks. Los Locos will spend this week gearing up for their match against Detroit City FC. Detroit sits in fourth place in the Eastern Conference standings. El Paso also is in fourth, but in the uh, West, Locomotive have been climbing up the standings. They've managed to come away with points in their last five matches. The team is in good form right now, but head coach John Hutchinson isn't ready for this team to take their foot off the pedal. I just really want to see our football keep growing. You know, I don't. I want to dominate teams for 90 minutes, not 60 or 70. I want the boys to outrun them. I want them to outplay them. I want them to have the ball. I want more penetration in the front third. I want crossing. I want finishing, and I want them to be ruthless. Los Locos are one of three teams in the Western Conference to gain some sort of points in all of their last five matches last week. A big reason why is because of a goalkeeper Evan Newton. Earlier today, the league announced that Newton landed a spot on the USL Championship Team of the Week starting 11. Newton had three saves against Phoenix. That earned him his fifth clean sheet of the season. Edon Gomez also solidified a spot on the reserves. Los Locos will look to keep up their form against Detroit City FC. The game will be on ESPN, yes, national television at 10 a.m. Mountain Time on Saturday.